in the roofing tile industry nano ceramic uses the new and modern technology ceramic nanoparticles along with other minerals and polymers are compounded to form mfp or nano ceramic mainly there are four models jcds eu1 series eu2 series and uc A single nano ceramic roofing tile weighs from 400 to 600 gram. As this tile is processed through MFP technology, it is lightning resistant and algae resistant. No water absorption and heat resistance are the added advantages of nano ceramic roofing tiles. Coffee brown, redwood brown, chocolate brown, steel grey, cloudy grey, moss green, bright blue. All these colors are available for nano ceramic roofing tiles. Interlocking system and self-thread screwing system is present in the tile. This helps in preventing us from high intensity winds. The square tubes used for structure fabrication is either GI or GP square tubes. The rafters used for fabrication is 80 by 40 mm. The distance from the center of one rafter to the center of next rafter should come in between 1200 to 1400 mm. This is the valley portion present in the truss work. It helps in collecting water from both the sides and helps in bringing it down. The sheets can be either aluminum or alloy. The width of the sheet is 450 mm. The angle of the roofing slope should be between 28 and 52 degree. If the angle is below 28 degree, it may lead to water leakage. Likewise, if it is above 52 degree, it would be difficult to place the ridges correctly. So right now, we are just going to take a look at the structure fabrication work of the U2 series. The square tubes used for the purling are 40 by 20 mm. First purling is placed vertically. The distance from the outside of the first purling to the center of the next purling is 275 mm. Rest all are placed in the distance of 311 mm from one purling to the next purling from center to center. So after we place the first tile, around 100 mm stays out of the frame. So for this reason, we have placed the second purling in the distance of 275 mm. So right now, we are going to explain the structure fabrication details of the U1 series. The size of the square tubes used for the purling is 40 by 20 mm. First purling is always placed vertically. The distance from the outside of the first purling to the center of the next purling is 240 mm. Rest all purlings are placed at a distance of 280 mm from center to center. When we place the first tile, around 100 mm of the tile stays out of the frame. So for this reason, we have placed the first purling at a distance of 240 mm. So right now we are going to explain the structure fabrication details of J series. The square tubes used for the purling is 40 by 20 mm. First purling is always placed vertically. The distance from the outside of the first purling to the center of the second purling is 180 mm. Rest all purlings are placed at a distance of 245 mm from center to center. After placing the first tile, around 100 mm of the tile stays out of the frame. So for this reason we have placed the first purling at a distance of 180 mm. So right now we're going to explain the structure fabrication details of U series. The square tubes used for the purling is 40 by 20 mm. First purling is always placed vertically. The distance from the outside of the first purling to the center of the second purling is 225 mm. Rest all purlings are placed at a distance of 240 mm from center to center. After placing the first tile around 100 mm of the tile stays out of the frame. So for this reason we have placed the first purling at a distance of 225 mm. Nano ceramic roofing tiles can be cut and utilized in any way. A 4 inch long and 1.5 to 2 mm thick glass wool mesh wheel can be used for this.